next up, coming to the stage is... Cal Carl Alberg. Ah! That's right. Get up here. Look at him saucing up here. That's right. Yeah, he's got some confidence. We like that. Catch the mic. Oh, my gosh. So... Father's Day, uh, I, I called my parents, FaceTime with them, and my sister's wedding is coming up in two weeks. My mom never said a bad thing about my hair before, but she's like, so Carl, are you going to do anything about your hair? I was like, oh my God. Well, uh, so it turns out that she's afraid that the uh, in-laws are going to judge her because I have Jesus hair. So uh, just, yeah, fun, fun little story from today. I wouldn't go too far. I'm trying, to st I'm trying to stay away from heresy here, but another time. Um, so I was going to read a passage from Earthseed. Um, one of my favorite novels that I read in the last year is called Parable of the Sower, and it's by Octavia Butler. Uh, she is, for those who don't know, she is a black woman. Obviously, I'm a white dude, and I find that it's very helpful from my perspective to read uh, literature by, you know, people of other races, people of other genders. Um, this is one of my favorite novels. Uh, and so here's just a kind of verse that's from that novel. Uh, Consider whether you're a human being, an insect, a microbe, or a stone. This for, hmm? No, this is good, sorry. Um, whether you're a human being, an insect, a microbe, or a stone, this verse is true. All that you touch, you change. All that you change, changes you. The only lasting truth is change. God is change. Thank you.